Hi, today we are going to learn about identifying field properties. Let's look at a problem. Name the property. Example, associative property of multiplication. 4 plus negative 4 is equal to 0. A, identity property of addition. B, substitution. C, inverse property of addition. D, closure. Now, whenever we add two numbers together and they become 0, this is known as the inverse property of addition. Inverse property of addition. So here in our case x is 4 and y is negative 4. So x plus y becomes 0. So our answer is C inverse property of addition. Next problem, name the property. Example, associative property of multiplication. 6 plus 18 is an integer. Now when we talk about 6 plus 18, 6 is an integer and 18 is also an integer. And we are talking about 6 plus 18, that is sum of 6 and 18. That is also an integer. So this means that addition here is closed. Integer addition is closed. That is, this is the closure property. You can say integer addition. So this is the closure property. Whenever something is closed under a given set, then the closure property holds. So A closure is the answer. Next problem. Name the property. Example, associative property of multiplication. Negative 3 plus 5 times 6 is equal to negative 3 times 6 plus 5 times 6. Now this is similar to this thing. A plus B times C equal to a times c plus b times c where I can say my a is negative 3, b is 5 and c is 6. And this in real numbers is defined as the right hand distributive property. Where our a and b and c should belong to the real line. So, we can say D distributive is our answer. I hope you can practice more problems on identifying field properties now. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.